What's going on, world? It's your boy, Animal, a.k.a. Enemise. And you know, it takes a lot of work to maintain a luxurious beard like so. And you know what really helps out with that? A luxurious beard product. So what I did was reach out to 10 of the best beard brands out there. Told them in exchange for a little bit of product, I created an honest and open review on how said products affect said beard. So without further ado, you now tuned in to the wild world of beards with your boy Animal. Let's get it. If you know anything about beard products, which I'm assuming some of you may, you know there's a whole plethora of products involved in the beard world. You got your beard oils, beard balm, beard combs, beard wash, beard conditioner, beard moisturizer. It's, it just goes on and on, beard pills. Like I said, there's a whole lot of them. The first one I wanna talk about is a beard oil called Powell's Beard Tonic. It's unscented, so for the people who aren't big on fragrance, you know, this one's for you. What I liked the most about Powell's Beard Tonic was that it just makes my beard really glisten. Like, you know, I put some on, you rub it in your hands, put it on your beard, and then your beard just glistens in the, in the sunlight. It's like, you know, you got some diamonds in your beard or something like that. So shout out to the great people behind Powell's Beard Tonic out in Arizona, bottling up some fine beard oil. All right, the next company I want to talk about is the great people over at Craft Grooming Products right here. They sent me some beard balm. They sent me some beard oil, some beard wash. And you know, first thing I noticed when I got the package to my house was, wow, this stuff smells amazing. Like I almost didn't want to open it and use it because it smells so good and I didn't want to start using it because then I'd run out eventually and then I'd just be not smelling good no more. So, you know, it took me a while to get into it. This one right here was my favorite product right here. It's called Faded, it smells like a mojito or something. You put a mojito on your beard or something like that. It's mint, eucalyptus, and you know, the oil that they gave was also super fragrant. Smells so good. This one's called Double or Nothing. Great products that they put inside of it. Great ingredients, I should say, that they put inside. Balm and the oil mixed together just made my beard super manageable, super light and fluffy. You know, the ladies dig that. You know, it's nothing like a soft beard. Gotta tell you. I get a lot of compliments when I wear this. A++ product, highly recommended. The beard wash, oh my God, it smells so good. The beard wash smells so good. So take a look out for craft grooming products. They got it on lock, so shout out to them for the pack. The next company I wanna talk about is a great company with a cool name. It's called Badass Beard Care. And you know, they sent me a wonderful beard wash, a beard balm, and a beard oil. And also, they just make you feel good about having a badass beard. You know, this came in a pack as well. So what I got was the Ladies Man Beard Balm. It says here that it's a lemon and vanilla scented. It smells really good. I really like this beard wash because it has like a minty kind of scent to it. Really makes you feel like you're getting your beard clean and have, have my skin feeling kind of tingly and fresh, you know? So don't fear the beard. Tame your man mane. Words to live by. So shout out to the Badass Beard Care Company. The people over at Primitive Outposts were not playing around. They sent me three different beer bombs to try out, as well as two beard oils right here. Down to earth, Vitality. They gave me the Vitality uh, beard bomb, Citrus Mint beard bomb, and of course the Down to Earth uh, beard bomb as well. And my favorite was the Down to Earth. It smells really good. Whew, smells so good. And you know, you put that on. They, they recommend you put the oil on first, then you put the balm on to maintain the moisture. What I recognized with this one was that it's kind of a chalky substance at first when you put your finger into it, but then when you really work it into your, into your palms and get that heat going, it gets super smooth and super slick. You just put it on and then it really just, it was like a hot knife through butter, you know, when I was combing through my beard, just super manageable, super easy to pick through. And uh, like I said, I'd recommend it down to earth or, oh, this Vitality is really good. That's uh, citrusy kind of scent to it. Almost smells like some oranges, you know. Citrus country Ramon de Lucia. I said that right. So shout out to Primitive Outpost for really hooking me up and keeping me afloat for a long time. 
Some great products you got on. This over. next company, Maestros. Now this might be my favorite product as far as functionality goes. Maestro's beard butter, as well as some beard wash that they gave me here. And you know, it's the Mark of a Man blend. This one is more, it's a different texture than everything else that you see here. It's, it's a, almost like a conditioner or something like that. So when you put this on, you just rub it into your beard. They say like a nickel sized amount or something like that, but every beard is different. When I put this one on, I'm telling you, it's like I've never had a knot or a nap in my beard ever. You know what I'm saying? It just really just instantly smooths out my beard and really makes it so easy to comb through and really makes it adds to the volume of it. So it's like a, almost like a leave-in conditioner for your beard, you know? It's, it's just really nice, really smooth, makes it super soft and uh, you know, the beer wash, same thing. It just really just lathers up so nice and makes you feel like, dude, I'm cleaning the heck out of my beer right now. You ain't even never seen a beer this clean. So shout out to Maestro's. Uh, love that product, man. Beer butter till I die. Now, this next product, Beard Farmer. They sent me this awesome beard wash here, as well as a beard balm, as you can see, and there's beard oil. Not to forget to mention, they sent me some daily supplement pills as well that are designed to help grow patchy beards and, you know, anybody who's struggling with the connection game, you know, I know that's a major issue in today's beard world society, probably since the beginning of beard history, you know. First thing I noticed was that the scent on this is a little strong. It smells like it's doing something good for you, you know. So uh, as far as like fruity fragrances or like minty or citrusy, this isn't really that. It's more so designed to invigorate your follicles. So if you're looking for something that smells hella good, maybe this ain't the one to go for you. This is if you want some results. So uh, the beard balm also made it very smooth. Same the same deal with the with the scent on that. It almost has like a kind of burnt smell or something. And also the product sits a little bit at the bottom. So they recommend that you shake it up like so. Shake it like a Polaroid picture and uh, then apply. So, you know, uh, I do have some little patches here, so I was very interested to see how the supplements would work. So I tried those out for about uh, three weeks and, you know, I couldn't tell if it was major results, but definitely saw maybe a little closing in the gap of some of these patches that I have, you know, that I keep under wraps. So very insecure about those. So let's not even talk about those too much. But I'm, I'm no science guy, so you know, I don't know exactly what these formulas do and stuff like that, but uh, definitely wanted to try this for a little longer and see, you know, independently of this review line just to see what, what it could do for me. So check out Beard Farmer and uh, give it a try if, you, if you're feeling any patches. While we're on the topic of beard growth, you know, for all my patchy brothers out there, uh, this next company, Beard & Company, I actually tried this one for a couple weeks straight. This is also designed to help grow uh, your hair and your beard. So, you know, just three to six drops of this into your palm, rub it into your beard daily, and uh, it's supposed to help you with your patches. Like I said, I had this little, little patchy little piece right here that I don't like to talk about, so let's not talk about it. But I did apply this to, to this uh, patch every day for about two to three weeks. Minimal results, but I think I have a deeper issue here. This is more for like, if you have patches, this seems like I just got a little bald spot or something. So the smell is good though. They have a, a very uh, sweet, almost, uh, tastes almost, it smells almost like trees or like a forest or something like that. So definitely good for that extra strength growth serum so if you guys are willing to give it a shot really put put your your beard uh to the test to see if you know you can grow some i recommend checking this out right here great product well this next company also did not hold back with the product they sent me two kits uh beard balm beard oil and uh also a comb as well uh, this is plant therapy they sent me the smoky lumberjack scent and the Urban Fresh set, yes. And uh, all of them come with this cool little beard comb and uh, handmade beard oil and a beard balm. 
Now, I said I would be totally honest in my reviews. Uh, the smoky lumberjack smell was not for me. It smelled like I was really in the forest chopping trees all day and came home after fighting a fire. And this was a little, little strong for my nostrils and to be right here on my beard, you know, pervading my, my, my nose smell was, was not that cool. But the Urban Fresh, I really like that smell a lot. Uh, definitely redeemed themselves with that product. The Beard Bomb makes your beard super smooth. The oil had me glistening, yo, glistening. Wow, you know, uh, I, I wasn't big on the smell. The results of the oil, undeniable. So, great product, naturally made. Uh, shout out to Plant Therapy for the product. Appreciate sending multiple scents just in case I didn't like one. Um, and Urban Fresh, go with that. And the final product, last but not least, was Beard Brand, who sent me two different beard oils. I had the tea tree beard oil and the spice citrus. My favorite was the tea tree beard oil. Smells amazing. Let me give you a little. Oh yeah, this smells like a minty, like a minty forest. Like you're just in a juniper. Is that how you say it? A juniper forest with uh, mints growing everywhere. And you know, it just had a really good feel to it. Felt minty, felt like I was, uh, invigorated my skin when I put it on as well as my hair on my face so uh, much appreciated to the beard brand they have really cool packaging I like that a lot so uh, much appreciated man thank you to everybody who was a part of this and uh, make sure you check out beard brand uh, all the other fabulous products that I listed and you know Thanks for tuning into the Wild World of Beards. Let me know if you got any other products that you really like or that you want me to review. And uh, I'll be sure to check them out. So this is your boy Animal signing out.